full staff in particular. That's a great opportunity for a designer. It's such an iconic character in Shakespeare. And of course, I think every designer wants to start again and reinvent it. Who does he look like? You know, what are your points of reference? But you read the script. There are more references, I think, to how full staff looks than any other character in Shakespeare. The size of his belly, what his beard's like, just his whole general demeanor. Everything about him is just so described that it's quite hard to kind of completely reinvent that. You just have to take all that information and make it as a vivid a character as possible. You have the added thing with Falstaff that he's clearly got to be a fat man. And on this occasion, we hadn't cast a big fat man. So we had to pad him. We looked at endless references, medical references of, of where you put on fat if you're of a certain height or width. And we built the padding from that. Tony then had the chance to work with it in rehearsals. There was a great emphasis on how he would get up from the floor, how he would sit on a chair, it would totally change him physically as, a, as, a, as an actor, let alone as a character. That was very much part of the, the whole process of finding full stuff. We designed no costumes, we built no part of his costume or made any of his armour until we got his body. And having an actor like Tony Cher to join in and, and guide you through that as well, and it's an actor and a designer coming together to find the character. And for me, that's the best work as a designer.